You are watching IndiaNewsTamar.com. I'm so happy to be right here in Chennai with many clever students from Sunshine School. I'm really impressed by what they have done through many drawings. We have a dump site here because uh, with smell and with a lot of garbage and a lot of waste and that should be cleared and it should be turned into a beautiful area for the citizens of uh, Chennai. And that's exactly what the students have done. Through the drawing, they have made ideas for museums, for statues, uh, for a Roman amphitheater, for housing complexes, for windmills, and above all, all students want the wetlands, the marshlands back so that birds can be here. That means migratory birds passing through Chennai, and it means the stationary birds who are living permanently in Chennai. This is a fantastic resort for all this wildlife. Uh, we are now passing the landmark where half of humanity is living in cities. Very soon also half of all Indians will be living in cities. Many will be living in mega cities like Chennai. And then we need to improve our cities, make them more livable, greener, and with more reflection on Mother Earth and nature. And that's exactly what the students of Sunshine School has done. So I'm really impressed with what they have achieved. I'm very happy to be back in Tamil Nadu and I'm very pleased to see that Chief Minister MK Stalin and the government of Tamil Nadu and the people of Tamil Nadu is now making this state a lot greener. Tamil Nadu is maybe the most advanced state in India and it has an enormous opportunity to lead India into the environment-friendly future. Tamil Nadu is now embarking upon a cleanup of these old waste sites, the dump sites where, where there have been dumped any amount of garbage up through the decades. Now they will be cleared and we will see uh, life coming back, birds and of course a much better, uh, much better parks and playgrounds for the citizens. Tamil Nadu is also embarking upon tree, uh, tree planting. The, the chief minister himself has been spearheading tree planting. That's very, very good. And Tamil Nadu is gradually moving into solar energy 
and into electric mobility. Meaning that the two-wheelers, the three-wheelers, the four-wheelers, and of course city buses in Chennai, they will go into using electricity, and maybe in the future also uh, green hydrogen. So I'm happy to see that Tamil Nadu uh, is now leading India, and India is playing more and more a uh, key role in the world uh, for the environment, being one of the nations driving the green change we do need to see on this uh, planet. There is an old saying from the Vedas, the whole world is one family. In that family we need someone to take the initiative and go forward, and Tamil Nadu is that. But we also work, to work together, United States and China, Europe and India, all of us to work together for a greener future for humanity. And congrats with all you are achieving in Tamil Nadu. So I think it's a great opportunity for the students of Sunshine Chennai Senior Secondary School to have an interaction with His Excellency Eric Solem. So children were told to envision how this dump yard to be in another few years. They have been visiting truck and un unloading lost waste materials here and then so they want to see a better beautiful Chennai. So they were asked to paint. It was given to them yesterday and they did a good job within a few short span of time. And Mr. Eric Solem gave lots of tips to the children how to, how to give importance to nature. So I do believe in the adults catch them young. So children are the future citizens and they have to, we have to create environmental awareness in them and make Tamil Nadu, India and the world a better place to live in. Thank you. Like, share and subscribe to IndianewsTamil.com